Hey everyone, Andrew Sports Fan here, and today I want to do a video based on a WF fan caller. I want to give my opinions regarding this caller because without this caller to Mike Francesa's show, <laughs> there is no Mike Francesa's show. I'm talking about the infamous Mike in Montclair, New Jersey. Yes. The reason why I'm making a video about him today was... I've been going on Twitter recently, and a bunch of Mongo Nation has been, you know, criticizing him, and I completely understand that for that reason. But, in my unique opinion, if Mike and Montclair does not call into Mike Francesa's show, again, there really is no show. First of all, I want to recap uh, for people who are first watching this channel. Mike and Montclair is a longtime caller to Mike Francesa's show. He calls whenever he gets the chance. I personally forgot his last name, but it's somewhere out there. His last name was revealed in 2012 when there was a poll that the listeners of WFAN did where Mike Francesa had four unique callers come into the studio. And Mike and Montclair was one of them. You had um, Bruce and Bayside. There was, um, I forgot who else. I definitely know Sour Shoes was one of the other callers. Uh, A.K.A. Mike and May at Pack, in case many people don't know who he is. And uh, I forgot the fourth caller. But Mike and Montclair was one of the callers that was featured. And it was a very good interview that he did a few years ago, which I personally enjoyed. And, um... The point I'm trying to make here is Mike in Montclair calls Mike Francesa constantly about the NBA and Mike Francesa teases him about it. Oh, you you claim you are not a fan of the NBA, yet you like to talk about it so much. And it, it it's very entertaining to, for me to listen to that. Uh, sometimes I uh, have my radio on me while I'm at work, uh, while I'm at home. Whether I am uh, actually have headphones, I can't listen to Mike's show while I'm in Manhattan. So I do have a radio with my smartphone. But the point is, I like to hear how Mike and Montclair bothers Mike Francesa about the NBA constantly. And to me, that's what makes good radio. And at the same time, Mongo Nation bashes him for it. And, you know... I can understand why they do because basically we all we have this question for Mike and Montclair all the time. Is he a real NBA fan? Because sometimes and, and we know this for a fact, Mike and Montclair actually watches a bunch of NBA TV. He does. This is Mike Francesa's claim. And the thing is, the question really is, is he a fan of basketball in general? I have mixed opinions when it comes to that, but in all due respect, if we do not have Mike and Montclair on the show, then there really is no Mike's Francesa show on WFAN. So, here's what I would like to see coming up after this video. I'm going to be constantly checking Twitter, seeing, you know, if he calls again, because RN's Funhouse did post a video regarding his latest call yesterday. And, and um, you can comment below if you know who Mike and Montclair is. And you can give me, my, you can give me your opinion of his on-air appearances with Mike. Because I like to hear what other people think about Mike and Montclair who are not in Mongo Nation. Because, you know, I have a bunch of people, especially Z-Man 1978... He'll probably give me a lengthy opinion, you know, after I'm done making this video. And uh, I'm sure Mike, Mike in New Haven is going to comment on this. So, yeah, uh, that's basically it. I just wanted to give my quick opinions on Mike and Montclair, the famous Mike Francesa caller. So, uh, that's basically it. I'm out.